The Helium Cycle at the Institute for Technical Physics. Helium, to be liquefied at very low temperatures, must meet very high purity requirements. Since helium resources are limited, the gas is collected and purified after use. In the helium purification system of the Institute for Technical Physics, the impurities from other gases, as well as oil and water, are removed in three stages. In the first stage, a coalescer removes oil droplets, and then an activated carbon filter absorbs oil vapors. In the second stage, the gas stream is dried. In the third, cold stage, undesirable impurities are separated out by freezing at liquid nitrogen temperature. The operation of the entire system is performed via a process control system. It starts with the compression of the helium gas. The liquefaction of the helium is carried out in a thermodynamic cyclic process in various refrigeration systems. After the compressed helium gas cools to room temperature, the gas goes through a multi-stage expansion. It cools to minus 269 degrees Celsius. In the final expansion stage, helium is liquefied in a dewer. The purity of the system is 99.99 99%. That means one million parts helium contain one part impurities. Helium liquefaction has a long tradition at the Institute for Technical Physics. The first system was established in 1969. By continuously monitoring the system components, we ensure that leaks are detected early. Different test stations, which are dependent on liquid helium, are attached to our helium systems. The Institute for Technical Physics thus ensures a comprehensive helium supply for the user. <laughs>